He's gonna, he's gonna make it. He's gonna make it. Doesn't he look great? Who gives their blessing for this woman to be wed? On behalf of her family, I do. Thank you. Our witnesses will please be seated.
11. Here we have gathered amidst this magnificent cathedral of God's creation that we may joyously unite this man, Bradford Clark LaPointe, and this woman, Sally Ann Murtis, in holy matrimony. For here in this valley, alive with the flavors of wine and romance, we now give our witness to the transforming power of love in their lives and affirm what precious blessings Sally and Brad have become to one another. Now you with Brad and Sally this day are indeed the most important people in their world. Realizing that, you make their ceremony all the more meaningful by your participation with a sincere respect for their beliefs, their values, and their desires. For this is Brad and Sally's day, their day in which they have given us the privilege, the privilege of empowering them to wonderful tomorrows through the blessings of our unconditional love and acceptance. Within their ceremony, each of us now has the chance to share in the most inspiring, comforting, and honorable characteristics of a long-established ritual. For that to be our reality, we must be willing to reach out to one another with an open, understanding, and an affirming spirit. In such a spirit as that, we celebrate the mysteries of romance that have brought Sally and Brad together to care for one another through all the varying experiences of their lives. Now, respecting this constant balance of life, of which they are to be a part, our assistant minister, Jacqueline, will now pour wine into two cups, from which Brad and Sally shall partake, to indicate their acceptance and their recognition that there will be both pain as well as happiness in marriage. <laughs> now, Brad, <laughs> Sally, this is the cup of joy and prosperity. Drinking from this cup, you declare that you will share equally in the blessings and bounty that life may bestow upon you. Can I finish it? Sure. <laughs> <laughs> and this is the cup of sorrow and want. Partaking from this cup, you symbolize before us that you will assume the other's burdens, trials, and tribulations, all the while realizing that it has been your sorrows that have carved a place within your souls for your joys to dwell. Complimenting this, let us now join in prayer with one another. 